I say sorry to you. You told me he's Mr. Chin. You think I'll believe you? I knew it. You are just a filthy cleaner. How can be familiar with Mr. Shin? Xiao Junji, keep your eyes open. He is Shin Nu. He is Mr. Shin. Liar. You think I don't know Mr. Chin? He doesn't look like Mr. Chin. What's going on? Sorry, Miss Fang. I've been abroad with you in these two years. Xiao Junji is just a vice manager of personnel department. I didn't give orders to him directly, so he may not know me. I'm calling the director of the personnel department. Leave it, leave it. There's no use hiring some actors. Listen to me, be realistic, having a state dream. She thinks we don't know. I knew it, a filthy cleaner. How could you know Mr. Sheen? Yes. What? Miss Fang will come and inspect in person? Mr. Xiao, what happened? Uh, Miss Fang is about to inspect each department. This matters. We must keep our spirits up. If Miss Fang is unpleasant with us, our jobs are in peril. How can this be? I warn you, during his arrival, behave. Don't ever pretend to be Miss Fang anymore. Due to shortage of manpower, you are now suspended only. After the tour, I will deal with you. Watch out. Supervisor Luo, I'm making you. Can you advance me a little salary? My son is seriously ill and hospitalized. The doctor said I need to chip in enough money to perform the surgery. I beg you. Get out of here. Whether your son lives or dies has nothing to do with me. Besides, Golden Age Group have never had a salary advance before. That is, what kind of poor wretch or sick wretch comes to work in our company? You are so poor going out to beg for food. It's really shame on our golden age girl. Supervisor Luo, I really need this money. I'm begging you. Ding Chamei, if you ask for someone, you must have the appearance of asking for someone. Have you ever seen someone standing to ask for help? I'm begging you, can you advance me a little salary? Ding Chen Mei, what are you doing? Why did you suddenly kneel down? Company regulation? You should know, it's absolutely impossible to be paid salary. Hmm, let's do this. You kowtow to me again? I personally pay 200 yuan. What money are you talking about? Of course, it's for your child. The money is for the funeral. <laughs> Manager, what are you talking nonsense about? Cheng Cheng will never die. Hello, Shin Mu. Ding Chen Mei's donation, have you not given it to her yet? Miss Fang. I gave the card to the personnel department immediately. What? Didn't they deliver it? It's the personal department again. What are you doing?